Since I have already enabled uh, or installed ActiveX control on IE on a workstation, I'm going to show you how to do that on the server machine and then go quickly to the workstation to use it. So I'm going to go open webmail here in, uh, in the server. So webmail acme.com slash oa I'm just going to look uh, log in again with Steven Johnson Pay attention. I'm just gonna click OK. Accept all the, the defaults here, just to show you how to do that that step. So click on the Options tab. It's gonna take some time to load the options, and then. Click the email security on the left hand side under option. See, it's going to ask you to download the Outlook Web Access S5 control. If the administrator has enabled this control on Exchange server, you will be able to download it. If not, this will produce an error. Because this was already done, we'll be able to use S5. So you just have to run it and install it. take some time but... you can see in the, the bar at the top I ask you do you want to trust the website so I'm going to say run add on and all websites run it now if you go back to email security you'll have it installed it gives you two options to encrypt contents and attachments and to add a digital signature you, it's your choice. If you check them here and save it, it's going to do that automatically for any outgoing message. If you leave them like this, you'll get the option to do that whenever you send a new message. So I'm going to leave it as is for now. Let's just make sure you save this. And that's it. So I'm going to go quickly on the workstation and set up same account again because here I've done, I've done that step just to show you how simple that is. So the website wants to run the following add-on. We say run the run, run add-on on all websites. So it's done. And Steven dot Johnson. All right. Now if we go to options everything is much faster so we'll see email security is already installed I can enable it now or not it's my choice I can save it and save is done successfully that's all we need to do to really if you go on Wind on Explorer if you go to tools I just want to show the menu bar under tools internet options content you'll be able to see the certificates that are installed on the local certificate store and you'll see Steven Johnson there as well you can view the certificate easily this is what we just requested